obviously they know George Burgess. Uh, you're down on troops, but so are uh, the dogs, mate. No Frank Pritchard for them. Yeah, for us it's it's about just being strong as a team and, and going in and performing for each other. Uh, yeah, we've got uh, great people coming in. Um, Joey Picker and Benny Lowe are coming in and they've played plenty of first grade. So uh, it's just about coming in and doing their job and uh, that's a, the job of task. Two blokes, I suppose, with a point to prove that would hope that they could make this 17 week in, week out. So that sort of brings a bit more fresh energy, I suppose. Yeah, I wouldn't say a point to prove. They just want to come in and do the job. I mean, I've got a tight team and, uh, you know, they just love playing together and, and doing it for each other. So, you know, they just want to come in and perform. Uh, we're playing against a team that uh, obviously is performing very, very well. So uh, we're going to have to be on our game at, at every moment. So it's about making sure we do that for each other. The dogs have sort of settled into a groove. They seem to sort of be more of what we probably expected of them last year. Yeah, they are. They're, um, yeah, they're executing their plays very well and they've got plenty of plays too. So, you know, between their forwards, they, they move the ball around and uh, obviously with their halves, they're, they're performing very well off the back of good go forward. So, uh, defensively, uh, you know, it's gonna, we're going to have to be at our best uh, you know, at everything they throw at us. Uh, there's been a bit of criticism about your discipline the last few weeks, especially the Burgess boys, with two blokes out suspended this week. Does it give the critics, some, I guess, some more ammo to fire at you? No, nah, not at all. I actually thought the last two weeks we've actually been very good. Unfortunately, uh, two incidences there with uh, George and uh, Benny. You know, it's probably more of a reaction, but you, know, you can't do that, and uh, we understand that, and that's uh, the reasons why we are in this position. But you know, it's, it's about making sure we go out and uh, play a disciplined game this week and, and play the way we can to our standard. Nathan Merrick got over for that try finally uh, the other week. Do you reckon that might open the shutters for him? Yeah, I hope so. I mean, uh, you yeah, know, for, for Merrick, it's probably been a bit of a frustrating time in the two months, but uh, with that sort of been hanging over him. But now, um, you know, we had a good chat last week, just about relaxing and just going and playing footy, and uh, sure enough, it came about. So hopefully, uh, you know, Merrick can you now you know, find the try line uh, many more times. And, uh, you know, it's a great achievement for Merrick. I mean, uh, for a record that's been, uh, you know, held for a long, long time, and uh, to be able to do that, uh, you know, and Merrick being a through and through South Sydney boy, you yeah, know, it's, it's great to see. Last two weeks, dogs have won by just one point. Have you been practicing a few goals certainly this week? Oh, look, every game's a, you, you've always got to practice all those little parts of the game. And uh, you, you saw on Monday night, obviously, uh, you know, how tight they can be. Uh, but, you know, it's, it's going to be an 80 minute game, and we're, uh, we're expecting that because that's how the dogs play. Hawkinson and Reynolds have been good for them the last few weeks. Are they the first two blokes you've spoken about so far? Uh, yeah, they've been really well. Uh, sorry, performing very well. Uh, yeah, off the back of their forwards, yeah, they, they, they've got two very quality halves there, and uh, you know, the way they compete um, is uh, you know, off the back of their forwards. You know, it's really taken them forward. So, again, as I said, defensively, we're going to be very strong. Back to last week, it was two in a row for you guys. Do you feel as though you've turned a corner? Does it feel like you've got that you know, start behind you? Oh, we've still got a lot of improvement in what we're doing. Um, you know, completion rates to, to control and discipline, all those sorts of things that happen in the game. But, uh, yeah, we're, we're turning the right track now and we've got to make, maintain that and continually improve in the things we're doing. But the competition is just showing how, how tough it is, um, you know, and how, how hard it is to be consistent week in, week out uh, with the, obviously the results that you're seeing. But, you know, that's, that's what makes the competition, uh, you know, so tough and, and be able to do that each week and the preparation you do through the week and, and how you go about things is your, is your focus going into the, into the game. I know when you name a team on Tuesday, all your coaches know that that'll be the side that runs out barring you know disasters and things. Is there anyone likely to force their way in late? Is there, are you getting any good news? Is there any cavalry coming from any any of your injured guys making uh, comebacks? Uh, Joel Reddy, he's, um, he's definitely uh, yeah, come back from his injury from uh, last week, so I've got to make some decisions at the back end of the week about which way we go with him. But uh, Lukey Kiri and Isaac Luke, they're working really hard, but they're probably still four weeks away. So um, you know, we'll get some good news as, as we work through the next month. But uh, you know, we, we've got a strong team, I believe, uh, at the moment with the, the players we've got. We've got to go and do a job this weekend. Match the Good Friday game has become a bit of an event in recent years. Is there any extra feeling going into it? Oh, the fact that we get a, a big crowd, I think, off, uh, off the Easter show and we get plenty of our uh, supporters uh, coming to the game. It's, it's always a pretty special game and uh, obviously you know, Easter time and uh, you know, there's, as everyone's on holidays and they like to get out of their footy. So, uh, you know, if we get a big crowd out there, it should be a really, really good game.